Unlike the A6 series that launched earlier in the year, the Galaxy A7, 2018, has a glass back and color matched metal polycarbonate side frame. Samsung has managed to restrict the overall thickness to 7.5 mm, even while housing triple rear cameras. Samsung also includes its Exo and S Pen with the Galaxy Book 2, which offers a smooth drawing experience. It docks to the tablet magnetically, which isn't the most secure way to stow your stylus, but at least it's there. Staying true to its design pedigree, Samsung has managed to avoid both the camera hump and the notch. While restricting camera bulge is laudable from a design perspective, and something Samsung practices even in its high-end phones like Galaxy S9 and Note 9, it also restricts the size of the camera sensor. Samsung sticking to its no-notch philosophy, on the other hand, is certainly commendable and warmly welcome. After cycling through a myriad different size notches through the year, the regular uninterrupted fascia on Samsung phones still feels natural and dignified. Another significant talking point here is the fingerprint sensor position. The Galaxy A7, 2018, houses the biometric sensor in the slight indentation on the right edge, clubbed with the power button. The power button is still clickable, but you don't need to press it for the fingerprint sensor to work. It's the always active type and all you need to do is place your thumb or any registered digit in the groove to unlock. We quite like the side-mounted fingerprint sensor on the Galaxy A7, 2018. The Galaxy A7, 2018, comes with a 6.0-inch display with Full HD+, 1080x2220, AMOLED display. Samsung makes some of the best AMOLED screens and the one on the Galaxy A7, 2018, felt fine for its price. The display is also protected by Gorilla Glass, version unspecified. The Galaxy A7, 2018, is powered by Exynos 7885 processor which is a 14nm process based chip with two 2.2 GHz Cortex A73 CPU cores and six 1.6 GHz Cortex A53 CPU cores. We have earlier experienced the same chipset on Galaxy A8 Plus and the performance as well. The chipset powering Samsung Galaxy A7, 2018, also supports dual SIM dual Volte. The handset comes in two variants 4GB RAM plus 64GB storage and 6GB RAM plus 128GB storage. Both variants accept up to 512GB storage. Interestingly, you can transfer apps and social media data to SD card as well. Micro SD storage is inherently slower than the SD card storage but this should still make external storage a lot more useful, especially in the long run.